Okay, hi friends. Um, I'm gonna do a little night routine video. Um, because personally, I have another video that's coming up, and I need to edit this video for that video. So I think you guys might know what that means. Secondly, I thought it'd just be fun to kind of show you what I do, in a sense. So yeah, right now I'm editing another video that'll be up shortly, and um. I'm gonna do some skincare while I'm at it because it's gonna take a little bit. So usually I use the Australian pink clay mask, but tonight I got something with my boxy charm. I got two of them actually. No, I think this is from Ipsy. Ipsy, and this is a le leech leech leechy, and that's like that correctly face mask. So I'm gonna put it on real fast because it's supposed to be a 15 to 20 minute mask. So let's. Do that. Um, sorry about that. You can't even see. While we're at it, I'm just gonna talk because, yeah, because why not? I guess. So let's crack this bad boy open. So um, I'm planning on doing, can you please open, um, a few more videos before I go on vacation, probably. And you probably like vacation, it's just in the state. I'm not going outside. Oh my god, this is weird. Um, oh my god, it smells so good. Oh, it's slimy. Oh. Oh. I'm taking a minute to stop so I can try and unravel. Whatever. Um, I really hope that I'm not ripping this. Um, it's just folded very intricately. This is probably not what people want to see. They're probably like, dude, this sucks. But, uh, same. Kinda. Oh, wow. Oh, so I found an eye hole. And... Oh, no. This is the eye hole. Nope. This is the eye hole. Upside down, my dudes. Now let's like, put this on properly. I think this is as good as it's gonna get. I have a small face, so these don't really work that well on my small face. I look ridiculous. I'm just gonna kind of move that over. I need to go dry my hands. I'm gonna take this. This will, of course, be on time lapse. Okay, so I'm eating the mask. So I'm back. Looking ridiculous. I'm gonna have to take this off. But, um, yeah, so I'm gonna edit real fast for 15 minutes. It probably won't take 15 minutes. I'll probably take this off earlier, but okay. If I can record what's on my computer. Oh my god, what am I doing? Go away. Oh my god, stop. like in my eye. It's really annoying. <laughs> okay. I'm actually gonna just come back when the 15 minutes are up because that's just a lot easier and then you have to look at my weird face. Okay so I'm back. This is literally falling off my face so I'm gonna take it off. Tasting it. Sweet. So I'm just gonna like there's so much of this, I'm just gonna like wash it under my skin. So the next thing I do is take this scrubby thingy for your face. And um, hi Rem, if you're watching, I use uh, Vanna Cream because it's better than Cetaphil. Just saying. And I get her on here. Yeah, this is better than Cetaphil. Just saying. It's gonna be weird, but. Yeah, I just wash my face like this. 
And then probably people are like, you should wash off the stuff you just put on your skin. Um, I'm no skincare expert, but I think it's good for your face. I really don't know. Um, this is the other little mask I use that I usually use for acne, but I'm actually doing pretty good acne free, which is weird to say. Um, this thing is weird, by the way. Just sorry about that. So it gets all that stuff on it. Let me turn it off. And do another run through on my skin before I like wash wash it off. Um, this is just to kind of get everything scrubbed into the skin. Washcloth. I already have one out. I just kind of brushed the rest off. Um, probably not gonna get anything, so I'm probably gonna go back in with the scrubber and rinse the rest of my face. Which people are probably gonna come for me for, so it's fine. My face is very red. I don't think that mask was good. Oops. I'm gonna take this. I'm just kind of drunk. The rest of that. I'm gonna take my contacts out over here because I think people have issues with watching people take out contacts. So I'm just gonna. They're dailies, by the way. Don't come at me. Um, I'm just gonna pat my face as a turn off. Unless I know I look crazy. I'm sorry. So next, after that, I'm gonna take some micellar water. This is from Mit, Mit, Maricel. Um, it's soap free and they don't test on animals. So that's a plus. So I'm gonna take that on a little thing. And if you guys know any good companies to get reusable ones of these, that'd be great. Um, yeah. Should have not done that. Don't do that when you scrub your face. It's a good makeup remover though. So yeah, I do that, and then I let that dry a bit. And then I have a lot of things that are about to go on my face. So I'm just get them all out. I already brushed my teeth, by the way. I don't know if I prefaced that. Um, next, I'm gonna put on. Yeah, I'm gonna do this one first. I'm gonna put on my. Is this the leaking? Mm. Um, Axon and Clean and Clear. I know Clean and Clear is not the best thing, but um, it's just to help. This is Dermatol. My own words. Dermatologist recommended to me by my dermatologist. So you can't really get these unless you have a prescription. So this is Axon. She's great. I love her. And then this is kind of like, I would say, the drugstore version of this. I don't really condone using it, but I just need to use it up. Um, they both have salicylic acid in them. Which is just gonna burn my skin, yes. Um, yeah. Personally, like the accent, but I pile both on just because. I'm gonna take the clean and clear. The two squirts. It's the dual action one. Uh, I rub it all, all over my face. I oh, my face dry real fast. So while my face is drying, before I put on my other moisturizer, and this little belief moisturizing eye balm, I don't know how to put it on properly, so I just use a Q-tip. I go under my eyes. That one had nothing on it. And I go under my eyes. Sometimes I go on top of my eyes. I don't know if you're really supposed to do that. I just do. So yeah, um, yeah, these are baby size. I don't know if you the big size, but like 60 bucks. And I'm kind of, you know, college students, bro. And lastly, oh, by the way, many of these like small items are sent to me by Ipsy in the bags or like birch box. So, uh, yeah, these are like those. Those same. Next, I'm gonna take the Murad 
water charge gel. I personally like the belief one because it's better. Sorry. But uh, this one's pretty good as well. So I take that. I don't know. Does mirror test on animals? See, I don't know. These are just samples, as I said. So I'm gonna rub that into my skin. And now I am glowing like a child. So I do that. And then I usually put on deodorant and put on pajamas, but y'all probably don't want to see that. Also, edit some more probably. Or not. I'll probably read a book. And right now I'm reading Invisible Man by Ralph Ellison. Um, I read it during my- wow, this is really not attractive thing. The junior year of AP Lit, um, first semester, and obviously you can see I have a lot of notes because I had to annotate it, but I honestly love this book so much that I read it, I think, multiple times after we were done with it in AP Lit. It's a satire. It's really good. It, ta it actually kind of covers a lot of the stuff that's going on right now, but I don't know, you know, just a little bit earlier in time. I personally love this book to dear death because it changed a lot of my thinking abilities. That was not a word. It changed a lot of my perspectives. Yeah, it's a really good book. And if you don't want to read Invisible Man by Earl Hillison because you think it's too long, uh, Plain Song, also a great book. This talks about a small town and um, different perspectives. It really good. It's like a story of a story of a story. Kind of like Frankenstein, in a sense. Also very good. I think it's by Kent Warf. Warf, yep, that's how I say the name. I'm actually turning this one into one of those, like, repurposed books because my therapist suggested it to me. So I'm doing that. And, yeah. Because this one's actually ruined. I might get a new copy and put all the stuff in there. Yeah. I'm trying to think of other... Th I could always find my duffel bag that I've been looking for. Also, this is my, uh, young blood wall. And I need more pictures. And one of them fell down, and this is a stretchy thingy. This is not, like, weird. It just helps me stretch my hips and stuff for skating. So I'm gonna take a deep dive and try and find this duffel bag. I have a lot of Yeah. Also, those are old, and I love them so much. Holy shiz. Knits. Is it back here? It is. Okay, it's back there. I'm gonna grab that. Put you there. He's here, right here. Okay. So this, this is still my night routine, by the way. Um, I always take this picture to the ground and put it back up where it's supposed to be, and it's gonna fall around midnight. Yeah, this just stretches my hips. And um, I use it for flexibility because I want to get my split jump, like my Russian split jump. But I don't think that's ever gonna happen. So yeah. Um, while we're at it, I think I'll just unbox my Greek box for you because I've been kind of like low key waiting to do that on camera, and I don't want to make it like a, a separate video. So I'm just gonna do it for now because I feel like it's a lot more fun to do. Um, warning: I did eat one of the items that was already in it. Um. And that item was a lollipop. So here's my Greek box. She's gorgeous. So the first thing you get is a Comfort Colors like tank top. This is for the month of June. It's hair on it. So um, I've already worn this about a couple times. So <laughs> that's why I've, I've kind of opened the box already. Next was a little mask. So I have this and it's like a good mask. I should probably like, so it has like the sorority name on it. Next is this super cool sticker. And these are actually customized to every sorority they offer on the website. I believe there's 26 they offer. I don't really remember. So the sticker is a Sigma Kappa. It's the bomb, like a bomb pop. Next, I got the super cool dad hat, my friend. Um, daddy it up. Um, I think it's cute. I'll definitely wear this around like. I want to say 4th of July, but I don't know what I'm doing for 4th of July. Probably nothing. I got sparklers. I don't trust myself with these. So I might just give them to uh, someone who wants them. 
Lastly, it comes with the little card they do every month. And it's like saying to shop local. Or they shopped local. They shop local. And so, like, basically, it's kind of like a subscri- It is a, subscri a subscription box. It basically just describes what you got. Um, the comfort colors tank, the ball cap, the tie-back cotton mask, the You're the Bomb, which was the lollipop. I didn't get that. I actually did. I ate it, though. And it's the Not Your Four Felt Sparklers. And then they always give, like, a little hint for the next month. So there's a watermelon. So I'm thinking, like, watermelon sugar. Hey! Um, if I don't insert a photo of Harry Styles there, please come at me. Um, it also always comes wrapped really cutely. So yeah, this was the Made in the USA box. I have the other two boxes, but everything's already out of them, so probably you don't care. Which, I mean, yeah, so I'm just gonna kind of put these. I really want to put the sticker somewhere, but I don't know where to put it. So yeah, that's my box. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. Look at that pose. Um, I don't really know what to do, because I don't really do nighttime routines, because what I do is just stupid. I just, like, sit up and watch Netflix, and you're like, you guys don't want to see- oh my god, my face is so smooth. You guys don't want to see that, so I'm probably gonna end it here. It's been about 13 minutes. I'll plus the other clip from before. So, like, 18 minutes. This is probably, like, super cool to you guys. You probably guys don't care. But, uh, yeah, this is my nighttime routine. I hope you enjoy it. I'm barefaced, have a giant zit, and my arm is wet from the water that I put on my face. Also, this is my um, Pixar lamp. He looks like a Pixar lamp. Yeah. And that's it. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.